Now what's this at the top of the cash slot? Here we go. This is the Alette Travel Wallet. So let's get this open here. Aha, here we have this. Ooh, I really like this. This is the mulberry color. Also comes in an indigo blue, a jet black, potter's clay, and collard green. Now those are nice names for colors. So let's uh, take a look here, just real quick. We always have excellent sewing that's done on Alette wallets. It's, it's done all properly with all of the stress points you would expect, where that's taken care of. Really well done, even down here in the smaller spots. You can get a feel of what this looks like. Very thin. Very flexible, so let's get going. There are several things that make Alette wallets stand out. One is they've taken seriously the need that most all other wallet makers miss, so keep watching. Nothing on the exterior. We can see, if we go to the interior, we can see on the left-hand side we have one and two uh, card slots. Well, if you know credit cards you want to carry, pass the two to 10 cards right here. Then we have a two interior document slots. We have a document slot right, sorry, right here and right here, right? This is for the passport. Really, you can hold up to two passports. It, it seems to work very fine. And then we have space for an interior pen slot. That is right in here. You can see that right there. We'll show that when we get into the crap card and cash insertion test, perfect for travel and other accessories, hides away as needed. And then we have two cash pockets. This is a full travel wallet, so it does include some cash as well as we're talking about receipt slots. Now, this back one only goes down about halfway. The one in the front goes all the way in. So depending on what you carry, again, uh, currency won't fit in this first one, all types of currency. You can get uh, you know, sh you know shorter currencies up here in this, as well as receipts or anything else. So pretty full function. It measures 5.4 by 4.1 by 0.2, and it weighs 31 grams or 1.1 ounces. A lot going on with this wallet, as a travel wallet goes. Six cards, six cash, this little micro pin back in here. Company recommends up to 10 cards and up to two passports. So I, I have this in like this, but you know, frankly, every passport control I go through, they require you to take it out. And so uh, I think just putting it in straight like this is the easiest way to do it. And thus it's secure. And then you can put another one on the exterior right here and that uh, keeps it all nice together. So with that being the case, let's take this out for convenience. And we'll talk about where this comes from. This is designed and made in the United States since 1995, actually. It's made of water resistant, ripped stop nylon material that is Blue Sign certified. That means every step of the supply chain has been audited to ensure environmentally conscious pro progress, factories, and materials are used. Now, the edges are rolled. You can see that because we have this seam that goes down right here on the middle where the nylon meets. Sewing is reinforced, we talked about in all the, the great places you would expect here. And you can see, of course, we have this pen demarcation point where the pen is right in the fold. And it is really just disappears in there nicely. Wonderful little slot for a micro pen. That's a micro pen that uh, Narwhal Co. sells that uh, we've worked with them to design. So I'll have that down in the notes below. Now what's this at the top of the cash slot? Let's see here. Well, we got the cash in here. Oh, interesting. Well, I think all we've got is this micro pen there, but I do know right in here we have something that's really unique. At the entrance, and this is a standard for a lot of wallets, you can see this right here. This is a silicon grip, and it's right at the beginning of this slot on both of them. And so when you put cards in, they're not going to easily fall out. They get, they get held in there. And that's uh, really important on cards. Uh, slots that face out. Uh, I think it's just a, a nice addition here so cards as you open them up aren't sliding out. But because this faces an internal fold, you know they're not just going to pop out anyway. It's priced for $52, which is not really too bad. I really like Alette's product offerings. Super thin, cleverly designed, always ready with a micro pin. Honestly, all their wallets have the option to carry a micro pin, which is really nice. And I, I think it's an important EDC item. I've seen the gradual evolution of the card slot grips that they've put right in here over time. And these are the best I've ever seen that they've come out with. Uh, very nice, unobtrusive, and really does its job. They understand the slipperiness of the nylon and what this can provide you. Now, while not always necessary, 
as a travel wallet. The ability to carry coins, I think would also be nice if you are overseas. And we don't quite have that here, but we really do have something most don't have, which is a, a very functional way to carry cash. For those who use passport wallets, this is a favorite for myself due to its in thinness and ease of use. Now on to the final score. For quality of four, price of three, features of four, usability of four, and perception of four. A lot of four going on here, and that gives us a score of 3.8 out of five. Now, if you'd like to see more Passport Wallet reviews, then watch this video next, and we'll see you in the next review. Goodbye.